Hello, Acadiana. Welcome back. It's a big college football weekend with some of the top names in the game facing off on the gridiron. If you plan to place wagers on these games, News 10 Sports' Jonathan Bulot has a few tips in this edition of News 10's Top Bets. The college football season is about to heat up. This Saturday, we have a huge slate of matchups, so let's try to turn some picks into some green slips on News 10's Top Bets. Let's begin with the team who might be the most explosive team in college football right now, the Alabama Crimson Tide. They are averaging 47 points per game as they head on the road to play Vanderbilt. The 17-year-old phenom Ryan Williams is looking like the best receiver in college football, and Jalen Milrow has the composure of a starting NFL quarterback. I see the Crimson Tide scoring at a high level against the Commodores Saturday afternoon. Take Alabama team total points over 38 and a half at plus 100 odds. Vanderbilt has allowed only 23 points per game this season, but have struggled with increasing competition as the season progresses. Let's head over to the home of the 12th man for a showdown between number 25 Texas A&M and number 9 Missouri. The Tigers went to double overtime last week at home hosting Vanderbilt, but still walked out with a three-point win. The Aggies also picked up a 21-17 win at AT&T Stadium against Arkansas, where they allowed three points through the last three quarters of the game. Missouri has not looked explosive down the field and has not played a game on the road all season. I think this will be too much for quarterback Brady Cook to handle, so I'm leaning Texas A&M money line at plus 128 odds. With a win, Texas A&M can begin 3-0 in SEC play for the first time since 2016. Finally, an underdog to watch is the Boston College Eagles. They've been better than expected this season and were able to pick up a win against Western Kentucky last week without quarterback Thomas Castellanos. Castellanos, yeah, he'll play this week, and good luck to the Virginia defensive unit. He's passed for 729 yards and 10 touchdowns while having 112 yards and a touchdown rushing this season. The line was flipped as soon as Castellanos was declared active, plus the Eagles defensive unit is impressive. Take BC money line at minus 113 odds. The Eagles will need to make sure to watch out for Virginia's ground game. They average 195 yards per game there. If they can challenge the run and finish drives on offense with touchdowns, I see an upset on the horizon at Scott Stadium. To look back at all of my bets, log on to our website, klfy.com. Please remember to gamble responsibly and stay tuned to KLFY News 10 throughout the NCAA football season for News 10's top bets.